in South Carolina, we're one of the top producers of teachers, and our graduates are highly sought all across the nation. I chose my health major because I wanted to make a change in people's lives for the better. It seems like she knows that there's stress fractures. They get first-hand experience from the moment they step in the College of Charleston as freshmen. The kids are doing a banana lab where they're extracting DNA from banana. And these are good things to have. Many of these students go on and present their research at regional and national conferences. With the College of Charleston, I feel completely prepared to take on the classroom. The College of Charleston School of Education, Health, and Human Performance is nationally accredited and recognized for excellence in teacher and pre-professional preparation. The school's name reflects its two distinctive areas. The Department of Teacher Education trains future teachers to help every child in every classroom. Students in the Department of Health and Human Performance study everything from health promotion to athletic training and exercise science to physical education. Students learn from dedicated top-tier professors and many collaborate on cutting-edge research. So which direction do DNA travel? I think through the practicum experiences, through their internships, they really get an understanding of who these children are and what they need so that they graduate, they're fully ready to become excellent teachers. Hundreds of graduates are named Teachers of the Year for their schools, districts, and the state. Lucy Beckham, the 2010 National Secondary School Principal of the Year, is also a Department of Teacher Education graduate. I'm here at the NE Miles Early Childhood Development Center at the College of Charleston where I work after school. And here I get to supervise the children's play and just engage in learning with them and apply the skills that I've learned in my methods classes. Less than 1% of the teachers in pre-K through 8th grades are African American males. Through the Call Me Mr. program, the school supports African American men preparing for the classroom. I want to become a better role model mainly to my students, uh, to show them that they can achieve what I achieve by going to college and just being somebody successful. The Department of Health and Human Performance is growing exponentially and attracts students with a wide range of interests. So this is Jason Allen. The program here is very impressive. The class sizes are small enough to where you get hands-on experience in your classroom so you can practice the skills that you are going to do on the field or on the court. Keep breathing! The College of Charleston faculty and students are very involved at Stahl High School with their physical education curriculum here. These are primarily CARVs. I am an intern for Louis Kids. The purpose of this program is mainly to help these children lose weight, but it's to also help them understand that weight loss is a multidimensional thing. From using computers to analyze human movement and performance to aerobic training, undergraduate research is seen throughout the College's Silcox Center. My interest area is uh, physiology and immunology. We have a more applied focus with professors who are interested in performance enhancement of athletes, making athletes faster, stronger, better. The School of Education, Health, and Human Performance is also home to a number of centers and special programs that contribute to the student success and the local community. The most important variable in the education of a child is the teacher. And so if we produce highly effective teachers, then we're helping to improve the education here in Charleston. We offer extensive options for graduate level programs, including our Masters of Arts in Teaching, and our Masters of Education programs, which focus on niche areas like ESOL and Science and Math for Teachers. Our graduates don't have easy jobs when they leave here, but they certainly are important jobs. 